In this video, we'll be looking into the regular expression topic and solve several uh, basic numericals. So, firstly, understanding the definition of regular expression. So, a regular expression is a string that can be formed by uh, obeying according to the following conditions or the rules so the first rule says that phi is a regular expression denoting empty language then we have epsilon is also a regular expression denoting a language containing empty string so next uh, let's consider two regular expressions given two regular expressions say alpha and beta so the product of those two is considered as regular expression union of Two regular expressions can also be taken as regular expression and alpha star is also considered as regular expression. This is called as Klein's closure. We'll look into this in the further videos. And then we have uh, alpha plus. This is also considered as regular expression and parenthesized alpha is also a regular expression. So, we need to understand that for a specific language, uh, a string that can be formed according to the following rules. So, all these rules could be obeyed to form the regular expression. So, we need to, now let's look into certain important uh, regular expressions and their meanings. Because this topic is incomplete if we don't discuss them. So first let's start from A star. So A star refers to a string consisting of any number of A's. Any number of A's. And then if we have uh, and then if we have A plus. So A plus uh, refers that a string consists of one or more A's. One or more A's. So, if there is A plus B, we can say that the string consists of either A or B. So, if it's uh, A plus B star, then we can write that uh, the string comprises of any number of A's and any number of B's. So, in this, there could be a null string as well. So then we have, uh, let's take A plus B star followed by ABB. So this tells that uh, string consisting of any number of A's and B's that is in the starting, any number of A's and B's but ending has to be with Ending has to be with A, B, B. So we have solved uh, like these types of regular expressions in our uh, first module. So yes, um, yeah, these are the basic regular expressions which you would come across and the meaning of that. So now let's solve uh, simple questions. So let me write uh, write regular expression over sigma is 0 and 1. So the first regular expression we need to write is for string ending with 0 0 1. So it would be ending with 0 0 1. So starting there could be anything that is 0 plus 1 anything 
star ending it has to be 0 0 1 so 0 0 1 similarly string starting with zero and ending with one so it can be written as starting with zero so let's write zero at the starting in the middle there could be anything that is zero or ones any number of zeros and any number of ones including the null string followed by that end it has to end with one so let's write one more condition that is string with alternate 0 and 1 okay for a string with alternate 0 and 1 we can write uh, it has to start with either 0 or 1 so epsilon plus 1 then we have 0 1 star that is a's and b's any number of a's and b's followed by that again we have epsilon plus 0 so alternate 1's and 0's right then let's take uh, another question writing regular expression over sigma is a b and c so at least one a and at least one b is our first question then we have strings of a and b of even length and odd length so these type of questions could be asked for two three marks so these are pretty easy so at least one a and at least one b so a plus b plus c star one a at least one a let's write at least one a then a plus b plus c star b Followed by that we have a plus b plus c star plus a plus b plus c star b and then a plus b plus c star and then a then we have a plus b plus c star. So this is how uh, at least one a at least one b uh, condition is satisfied. Then for even they have asked. So it will be a plus b and here it has to be a plus b star and on this side we have a plus b and then we have a plus b and a plus b star. So if it's even if you add one more then it will turn out to be odd right. So that's the uh, basic logic behind uh, writing the regular expressions. So I hope you have understood the definition and uh, the basic type of uh, regular expressions and their meanings so if you have any doubts do let me know in the comments and subscribe to my channel if you require the notes um, do let me know in the comments and thank you